Okay, this is a remontoire or self-winding clock. The most important part of it is this loop of chain. This drives the escapement on this side and on this side you can see that there is a motor which drives the chain on this side. Now when the weight gets to the bottom of its travel, which it is about to do, okay, it operates a switch that starts the motor and now the weight is traveling up, rewinding the chain. When it gets to the top, the motor stops and now the weight is driving the chain by moving down. Let's see that again. We'll let the weight go all the way to the bottom of its travel. When it gets to the bottom, there is a switch which you can't see, it's behind the weight. There it is, it operated. Weight comes up. And then the switch stops the motor, the weight descends and continues to operate the clock. Uh, one important thing about this clock is that the beat of the escapement doesn't change while the motor is rewinding the chain. In a lot of self-winding clocks the clock either stops while it's rewinding or the beat changes significantly. In this one it stays the same and I'm most impressed with that. Okay that's it. Thank you for watching.